All right, what is going on guys? Spyvolts back again coming at you with a Max Transcended Masaki Showcase. Now we are going to be doing just the Nat build because uh, he didn't level up the SP. Honestly, I think that she would perform well in a hybrid setting, but like, hey man, if, you, if, you, if you're not going to play with her uh, under the hybrid build, then you're like, you might as well just not bother doing the SP because like you could best use these scrolls elsewhere right so human quincy with a no affiliation killer normally that would hold the character back but i don't think that it holds this character back in particular now she does have a normal attack damage soul trait so she's going to mainly be for um pve content rather than pvp because honestly i do feel like you need dr to really excel in pvp however her second strong attack in my opinion definitely helps out so the I feel like she would actually be somewhat useful in PvP just because she does have the flurry, she does have the poise, she does have the guard, not well, guard break doesn't matter, but the flurry, the poise, the enhancer, team boosting unit with barrier. Uh, on top of that, she does have a freeze immunity. She has a bruiser of 60% that does not take into account her normal attack damage link, which means that she has a bruiser of 80% built into the character with flurry <laughs> with a berserker of 50%. This character can be built hybrid. She has guard break, she has hit hidden enemies 100%. Poise, Sprinter, Enhancer, Flurry, bro, like literally, this woman has the entire package. The only thing she's missing is a set of double Ds, but honestly, bro, sometimes that's a little too much. You feel me? So we are rocking attack 30, 30, 30 across the board. Unfortunately, we don't have a gold chappy, but uh, I mean, you're not really missing out on too much damage. I want to say you're going to be missing out on maybe like 5 to 10% damage if you uh, swap this out for a gold chappy, I think. Think. I mean, I got to run the numbers, but it's something along the lines of that. Uh, but as you see here, we are running the all the normal attack damage items. And um, yeah, I mean, Masaki is an absolute beast. Now, uh, going into her actual kit, we'll get into that as we start the run. I've been fooling around with this character quite a bit. Uh, in my review, she was uh, quote unquote nerfed because she uh, her second strong attack wasn't lasting as long as it's supposed to. So uh, for those that watched my previous review of her, um, just know that they have since fixed that and she actually performed she, she's even better than she was in that review and honestly she was already really 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 good now going into it you'll see that her nad string let's see boom 30k straight up off rip that would deal an extra 24k yeah that would, that would deal an extra 24k in terms of just the normal attack damage because keep in mind that there's no no affiliate excuse me all these enemies have an affiliation <laughs> so uh, she would get an extra 60 percent damage on that so 30k would turn it into 54k which is really really crazy because that means that she's hitting for 108k without her boost boom boom yeah 30k that's actually really good and the 24k is really good too considering that those are just your regular nad hits right that, that's not even the final one pop pop 31k oh my god now this uh, is an 800 AOE distant there's uh, second strong attack 40 okay I need a build up combo um <laughs> uh, we need a build up combo give me one second guys yeah so 46k times 1.6 equals 73k per hit times 2 147k on the last hit with her um with her boost on now what I'm gonna do real quick is go into the inheritance zone but i'm going to swap in for a, a vortex unit just because uh i do want to build up combo relatively quickly uh let's do this not bring an ally now i'm interested to see exactly how hard she'll hit when we have our full combo bonus because like 46k on a nat hit is actually quite incredible and not many characters can do that now sure she has a no affiliation killer but like even with killer the only person who's dealing like more damage here is probably going to be someone like Tokinata. Now, let me actually just finish these guys off just so that way uh, these guys don't die in the middle of this strong attack. And they still pretty much died in the middle of it, but that's fine. Range Collision King, let's go. <laughs> oh my god, he really is Range Collision King. All right, so, I mean, we already got our combo bonus right here. That is awesome. So we can actually check out the damage. Boom, boom, 31.7K. Um, I feel like we can get a little higher than that. Honestly, we should be hitting something along the lines of, like, 34K on the crit. Oh, one, two, three. Boom, look at that, 34K. That is really good, considering that's without the boost. Let's put our boost on. You'll see that, that actually hit in uh, behind us as well, uh, slightly behind us. Not quite, like, crazy behind us. Boom, boom, 48,000. That is so good. Oh, 
48. Oh my gosh, she's so good. Oh, our boost is gonna run out. No. Apologies if you can hear my dog. Like, my mom's home. I, I don't know who taught my dog how to bark, bro. But like, you know how some dogs bark like crazy and they sound like really uh, aggressive. My dog doesn't sound aggressive. He sounds like he's like dying. <laughs> And it pisses me off because I'm just like, yo, people are going to hear this dog and think they like he's getting hit or something. And it's like, I mean, he he gets spanked sometimes when he pees all over the floor. But I mean, he, at that point, he kind of deserve it. <laughs> all right. So let's uh, put our boost on. We have our combo bonus. Um, He usually does his strong attack. Boom, boom. Oh, look at that. 46.7K. Holy. Okay. Now, if 46... 0.7k times 1.6 right 74 per hit times two we're hitting 150k on a nat hit with a boost no weaken no weaken defense literally just the boost itself all right so this is going to be a little trickier what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to put on a full stamina damage boost uh depending on whoever has the weakest uh, you know what? Let's uh, go with the full stamina damage boost of this, because this will actually give us more damage, right? So 156. Uh, this one's going to give us the worst uh, stat bonus, quote-unquote. So we're going to do that. Uh, no allies still. Full boosters. And we're going to still bring the vortex units for the combo bonus. We'll test the before and after and see exactly uh, how much damage this girl can deal. Uh, oops. Boom, boom. 34k all right <clears throat> that's 34k off rip that's not even like 35.8 hold up 35 8 times 1.6 57 times 2 114.5k so this toshiro is definitely making us hit significantly harder <laughs> all right so let's uh let's try this on with the boost boom boom Oh my god. 48k. We almost hit 50k. Damn, we our, our boost ran out. <laughs> Alright, so let's uh, pop this off real quick. Let's, uh, let's use our com. Uh, excuse me. Let's uh, use our vortex. Let's, there we go. Boom. <gasps> it wasn't registering my dodge. Thirty-seven point. Uh, that was. I saw the thirty-eight k. Thirty-nine k. Wow, that is so good. All right, so we're gonna pop that off. 55,000 with the combo bone. I mean, I, I we, we, we did hit fit like almost 50k, which obviously 10% more than 50k is 55, but like just seeing that number is bonkers, bro. Hold up, because <laughs> like 55, and then I want to say it was like 400, it was something kind of crazy like that times two, bro. That is that's 2.0, uh, 177.2k with the nat hit. No weekend defense, no boost. I'm sorry. I'm laughing because, like, yeah, <laughs> you know, I was talking with someone, you know what I'm saying? And, and and they were asking me. They're like, yo, Spy, do you think they could ever make a character more broken than Tokinata? And I'm like, of course, just give him a higher bruiser. <laughs> Literally just make Tokinata over again and just give him a higher bruiser. That's all he that's all you would need to make Tokinata again. And they literally made it. And not only did they <laughs> The funny part, the, the funniest part is like the second strong attack is even better than Tokinata's because she gets a barrier with it. And not only does she get a barrier with it, 
but it's an 800 AoE distant. It's literally, yo, dude, well, when I said, I'm like, the only thing that would make this character even better is if he had an 800 AoE instead of the breath attack that Tokinata has. And they literally gave it to Masaki. <laughs> imagine, yo, imagine, yo, if you told me, if you told me, <laughs> yo, I'm trying, compose, compose yourself, compose yourself. If you told me, like, three years ago, <laughs> that Ichigo's mom was the best character in the game, I think you were fucking lying, bro. <laughs> well, I'm gonna leave it at that. You guys can I'll catch you up. Here we go. Stay blessed. Like, comment, subscribe, and you hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. <laughs>